Good morning, everyone. My name is Jonathan Marks, and I'm the technical co-founder of Quorum, as she said, an online legislative strategy platform that provides unique quantitative insights into the US Congress. Two years ago, when my co-founder and I got started on working on this project, I was a complete political outsider. My very political, political insider co-founder teased me because I couldn't pronounce the names of the senators correctly. What I knew about politics came pretty much from the New York Times, and I had no idea how the system worked. But I knew one thing. As a political outsider, I was frustrated with politics and with Congress because it didn't seem like anything was working. Little did I know, but many members of Congress, many members of the advocacy community, and many po real political insiders were, felt the same thing because politics in Washington is conducted right now without the benefit of using modern technology and big data. Interns go through and compare different versions of bills by hand. Even senior partners have to go through at times and try and tabulate vote results by hand, trying to figure out trends or attempting to figure out which members of Congress most, most care about their issues. It's a mess. It requires a huge amount of time and effort to find real insights into what is going on. And so two years ago, we set out to try and solve this problem. And what did we do? Well, because we are a cloud-first, AWS-based bootstrap startup, we were able to leverage a huge amount of computational power right from the outset. We first needed to find all of the information because right now, there's no central API to access legislative information, either at the federal level or at the state level. There's no ability to go through and search all of the different press releases from different members of Congress or try to find what people are saying on the floor or in committee hearings. And so the first thing we did is we built the world's most comprehensive database of legislative information. Every bill, vote, amendment, press release, floor statement, tweet, Facebook post, dear colleague letter, and more, and put it all into a centrally managed, easily searchable and accessible database. We then proceeded to build a quantitative analytics layer on top of all these data so that instead of just having access to the information, instead of just relying on all of our thousands of scrapers that go to thousands of different websites each and every day, we could actually figure out who's most effective in a given issue, which member of Congress cares about something, who's most likely to actually sponsor a bill or work with someone based on how many times they've worked together in the past. A couple more examples of this. We worked with Kevin McCarthy, the majority leader in the House, to show that this Republican Congress is actually the second most effective Republican Congress of the last 40 years. And we worked with Vox to show that while bipartisanship is below the historical 40-year average, we've actually seen an uptick if we measure the times when Republicans and Democrats worked together on legislation over the last six years. And finally, we worked with the New York Times this spring to, show, to look at how female members of Congress work together and show that your average female member of Congress is almost twice as likely to work across the aisle with another female member of Congress than your average male member of Congress is willing to work across the aisle with another male. Once you have the ability to access all the data and to have it all be centralized and accessible, you can actually figure out what it means and how you can use it to inform and expand your decisions. And then finally, we built all of these different tools, the data sets, the, access, the ability to search and sort and filter, the ability to find different insights and quantitative and analytic tools, and put it all into an online, easily accessible platform where not only can our users access this information and access and use these quantitative insights, but they also can access productivity tools, collaborate, collaborate in real time amongst their teams, figure out differences between two different versions of a bill, a process that used to be done by hand that took hours, or make those spreadsheets and collaborate, share them amongst your team, and do all of this with just a couple of clicks and have it auto-update and come to you directly instead of having to do all of this by hand each and every day. Without the power of AWS, what we've done over the last two years would not have been possible because we're a bootstrap startup. We haven't raised a single cent of outside money and our funding, our 10 person, person operation, completely based on revenue from companies like Toyota, GM, the United Nations uh, 
Population Fund and other organizations that are supporting what we're doing. Uh, and AWS gives us the power and the flexibility to gain, get the data we need, to analyze it quickly and comprehensively in real time, and then to provide these services to our clients and to do this quickly, easily, and at very low cost. Thank you very much.